Articulate Rise doesn't offer a direct word count feature, but we've found two main workarounds for you. Let's get started. The first solution involves exporting your course as a PDF. So, start by clicking on Publish, then select PDF. Note that for large courses, generating the PDF might take a while due to the inclusion of images. Once the PDF is ready, go ahead and open it. Use Ctrl plus A to select all the text in the PDF, then copy and paste it into a Word document. At the bottom, you will see the word count. And there you have it, the first method to get a word count. However, be aware that this method won't count feedback provided for knowledge checks. So, for a knowledge check with feedback, the text that you have entered here will not be counted. In our tests, this method generally yielded a lower word count compared to the second solution. The second solution is more tech-savvy but often faster. In RISE, head to Settings. Under Translations, click on Export XLIF file. This will generate a XLF file, which doesn't include images making the process quicker. Next, use the Hero Word Count app. It's a free Windows app available in the Microsoft Store and operates locally, ensuring your data remains private. We've provided a link to it in the video description. After installing, direct the app to your .xlf file, identify it as a RISE 360 file and click Get Word Count. This method even counts feedback in quiz questions, an advantage over the first solution. However, some might face access restrictions to the app in organizational settings. A workaround is using smartcat.com. Sign up, upload your .xlf file and get your word count. Alternatively, your organization might have other translation tools compatible with .xlf files. And there you have it. Two effective methods to count words in Articulate Rise. If this blink fast solution was what you were looking for, please give this video a thumbs up. And for more efficient tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to Blink Solve Tutorials.